hello everyone so today I'm going to actually demonstrate to you how the leave can be approved by the supervisor or the principal for the staff so click on leave management once you click on leave management then click on approve leave so this opens up a screen which displays the the staff list for your department or the school now once this is done what you could do is you could see that may it shows you up, up, uh, applied 8 it is in blue color which is not authorized and if you want to see the list of all the staff members you can just click on search option or if you don't click on any staff member just click on search option it will display the list of all the people who have applied whose leave have been authorized which is pending for authorization so in case you need to approve leave for any staff so just click on the request ID in this case so as soon as you click on that ID it shows what kind of leave is it what date it has been applied for also whether you want to approve it reject it amend it or revoke it so depending on any one of them revoke is when you want to when you've authorized a leave and you want to you know change it back again so that's where you revoke it so in case if I want to approve this I just click on the approve button it takes some time to process it so it would just show you a message that leave approved successfully so now to go back to the screen click on approve leave again follow the same procedure of selecting the date or just clicking on search so here it shows you April in green color that means all have been approved in April now comes me so if I click on this request ID so it shows me number of days shows me type of leave earned reason as vacation so I click on approve and that's done so the same process has to be followed for all the leaves to be applied it's always a good practice to log in once and check this every day you can specify the from and the to date so that you get only specific dates data or you can select the status which is pending for authorization for create alter or cancel so that's it uh, this is how you'd be able to do it if you select the status as authorized it shows you all the leaves which are authorized for that particular time span also in the team leave panel you can select the month and get a summary of how many people have applied for leave in that specific month so if there are any queries uh, you can contact the IT department and thank you for watching this video